Live from a cute little corner of Austin, Don Bluth is still alive, though strangely spinning in his grave. It's going to be a great night. And now, one of these hosts thinks more about his dumps than he thinks about his three daughters. It's Brian Brushwood and Justin Robert Young! Woo! My favorite part is that he didn't divulge which one of us thinks more about their dumps than our daughters. is probably you statistically uh, I speaking. I I'd any, say I that's any, true. I don't have any kids. Right? So you probably don't. All right. True, true fact <laughs> of the two of us. Yeah. Do you, uh, do you think more about your dumps or my daughters? My dumps? All right. <laughs> Checkmate. Uh, uh, Br- Brian Brushwood. Yo. Uh, uh, man, what's what's going on in this crazy world, huh? Uh, you know what? You know, I this kn- world. I was looking at it the other day. This crazy. was. Yeah. Wait, really? Too crazy for me. Uh, I know this much. I know that uh, just now, as I walked into the room, <laughs> Bonnie texted me a screen grab of some next door BS. Really? That just says. WTF did I miss? And uh, I'm going to try to redact as much as I can here. Okay. Uh, this is a segment we like to call local doxing. Local doxing! All right. <clears throat> <laughs> no, come on. No, no. Don't okay. All right. Do the thing. We're okay, saving right. it for another thing. No, no, no. I was going to do a different thing. That's fine. Uh, <clears throat> change.org. Are you familiar? Change. Oh, yeah. No, that was that was a, a it's a petition site where you petition things. Yeah, that's right. It's the social network created by Barack Obama. Yep. Yep. Uh, uh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. <clears throat> right. Recall and removal of blank board member blank for gross. <laughs> I just no, realized you're doing Obama. <laughs> yeah, I am. Can you read uh, it all for, uh, as Obama? All right. <laughs> folks, you have to start with folks. Folks, but folks, let me explain something. When I first created change.org, <laughs> I can't look you in the eye. <clears throat> Here we go. Center yourself. Right. Three, two, <laughs> one, Obama. <laughs> All right. He can't help me. All right, here we go. Okay. okay. <clears throat> go ahead. Uh, folks, this petition. Would it help if I did Joe Biden? Uh, yes, it would, actually. All right. All right. <clears throat> all right. Hey. All right. Hey. All right. Joe, you can do it. Joe, come over here. You come over here. Yeah. Listen. Hey. Ever, ever since this last... is the worst, <laughs> the worst two impressions. <laughs> no. And now all I want to do is keep doing it. <laughs> hey, man. Hey. It's very Here's good, Joe. You Here's should be deal. you should be president someday. I don't know. I don't uh, know. Uh, yeah. I think I might uh, fuck up Afghanistan and my pocket. Yeah, no, that's it's not possible. They have, uh, have, have three hundred thousand uh, troops. It'll be yeah, let me tell you something, it'll be just fine. All right. Okay. Now listen, back yeah. to my, my social network that I created, change about I want to clip this on Twitch and then send it to friends and ask them who we're doing impression stuff. <laughs> Just so I can see the replies. All right, so listen. I made my social network. (laughs) Change.org. What I didn't predict is far in the future, people would use it for controversial things. Like, recall... (laughs) you morphing Obama into (laughs) T-Techie (laughs) Texas. Here's the deal. Here's the no joke. Now listen. No joke. No joke. Now listen. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I like to believe we're all part of the same community here, Uh and everything can bleed together, blend together. Like if everybody cut their, you ever hear of blood brothers? People who slice their hands together and shake hands, and then their blood mixes. Don't do that. This is all in the (laughs) change.org petition. Yes. Uh, Recall removal for so and so board member so and so for gross negligence and incompetence. It's me, Barack Obama. (laughs) Uh, uh, What do you think that would be? It's it's all it's already about to hit uh, all of the signatures locally for the audio. And it's we've now stopped doing the impressions. uh, (laughs) Yes, uh, uh, I, I, I will reveal that it is school board related. There is a school board, yeah. and there is a change.org, Petition Barack Obama's to, social to, network, yeah, to, yes, to, to, to remove somebody, somebody from for gross ig- ignorance or negligence. Negligence. And what's the question again? Uh, what do you think it's about? Uh, I mean, I would guess probably mask stuff. Yeah. What side do you think they're on? Oh, the anti-mask stuff. Really? Yeah. <laughs> 
I didn't see that coming. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, because we live in a state where the governor had done an anti anti mask thing, like, uh, or, 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 uh, yeah. And then the school boards were like, no, we're gonna, we're do gonna make it a dress thing. code or whatever. Yeah. Um, okay. All right. Well, if anyone <laughs> did, I get it? I have no idea. I only got the screen grab. <laughs> I'd ha I, I would have to look it up. I just wanted to do no, that impression. We just like, man, to read the thing. Is it, it's called getting loose. It is yeah. getting loose. <clears throat> Joe. Listen, I'm going to need you to calm down. You're going to freak out in Afghanistan. Not a joke. Not a joke. <laughs> Not a joke. Hey, really? The more... Now, listen, Joe. The hey. more we do these impressions, the worse they get. <laughs> the more clearly East Texas Barack Obama, just saying, Illinois senator, becomes... <laughs> I don't even know who this is. <laughs> that might be the most accurate Biden impression that I've done. <laughs> and the more we have to rely on actual content. No, uh, come on over here. Let me show you this Cadillac Coupe de Ville. It's going to treat you right. You're going to take you for a not long a time. Not a joke. <laughs> I'm just going to stick with not a joke. I feel like that's my only safe space. Uh, Bryce, give us uh -huh. a first topic. All right. Our first topic is... Much love to Mike TV. Oh, hells yeah! Uh, Ladies and gentlemen... Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, sorry. Go ahead. You had something. So, guys, we... Uh, one week ago uh, brought you the, the unfortunate news that our friend and family member of Diamond Club, Mike TV, was in a big accident, and uh, you guys could help uh, uh, with his bills, and a uh, holy shit. Uh, Brian, it was... 15,000 was the goal. We raised over half of it during the show. And do we know what it is right now? And, and before we reveal that, let me, let's make it clear. 15,000 was a rough back of an envelope yeah. estimate. It was an arbitrary we, number. Arbitrary we still don't number, know. Yeah. It's just like, please help. If, 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 if you're listening to this and you think you're too late, you're not too late. You could make a big, big difference in the life of somebody who you've heard for 10 years on this very program. Yes. Uh, and... Right now, as we speak, can we uh, can we can we bring up the the GoFundMe at bit.ly slash help Mike TV? All right, here we go. The amount is bum 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 twenty seven thousand three hundred seventy seven dollars. Oh my mm -hmm. god damn! All right, so so number one, uh, yes, everybody. Now that yeah. we actually have an audience. By the way, that feels, uh, that feels good. We yeah, got a, we got an audience here tonight. Uh, capacity crowd, right? This Basically. is where we flash over there. It's like uh, thirty-seven people, <laughs> <laughs> thirty-seven eyeballs. Uh, yeah, uh, which would mean somebody doesn't have it. All right. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, didn't think through that one. Or, didn't yeah, think no, through that one. Uh, so. <laughs> Mike is actually doing fantastic. Uh, uh, he is is healing really well. He went to his doctor, and uh, uh, we will have more news on his recovery as we have it. But just know I, I, he is thrilled that not only are at least the, the, the immediate kind of bills, and he hasn't received a bill from the hospital yet, so we don't know for sure. I gave, uh, him, the, I gave him the call, by the way. About, oh, about, about the used car, and, uh, and it's like, uh, don't you dare take it, uh, pay whatever they send you. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, spoiler alert. Uh, 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 for If there's anybody who works at a hospital who knows how hospital billing works, trust us, we are guiding him down the correct path to handle this situation. So yes. uh, everybody, uh, thank you one more time. If you have not chipped in, uh, this isn't just about medical bills, by the way. Because uh, Mike had a jaw fracture, we do not know how long... It's going to be before he can ply his trade right. and singing again. So if you are donating money now, you are also donating money for him to actually live because he cannot, like, he cannot do he cannot what his do profession his, his is. His trade, yeah. yeah. Uh, I, I think about it, uh, you know, future bills of uh, physical therapy, uh, uh, all of that kind of stuff. Um, I, I hope, uh, so bit.ly slash help Mike TV. Yes. Bryce! Our next topic... <laughs> Beep, beep, kaboom. <laughs> so normally, we know which of us this is about. <laughs> uh, oh, uh, this is you, Brian. Uh, I don't know if you've had any car experiences <laughs> in the past week. God damn it. Okay. <laughs> you mean beep, beep, cut. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got to peel the curtain back just a little bit, just a touch. We have a meeting at five o'clock. 
and we we all throw out topics so we can populate the first part of the show. Don't 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 you throw me under the bus. I'm not throwing you under the bus. Okay. Oh, don't throw, throw me under the bus. I'm throwing Bryce under the bus. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> because uh, look, uh, Bryce has a lot to set up at the very beginning of 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 when he comes in, and so there's a lot of Bryce plugging things in and making things work. As, uh, as as long as we're describing it, it's like imagine if before doing a gig, the two people who are going to be the principal uh, faces on the gig said, yeah. Listen, why don't you show up an hour early and we're just gonna throw all the balls we can find at you <laughs> and you just catch and juggle as many as you can and then we're gonna go have a beer. <laughs> and and that's what Bryce has to go through every freaking week, and it's totally unfair. All I'll say is this. Uh, <laughs> I am in, I am completely lost. I, let me let me finish what I'm saying. Okay. All right. Brian <laughs> Brian's ball juggling aside. Uh, <laughs> We normally throw some stuff in the, in, 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 into the doc, uh, uh, and, and in the 5 o'clock meeting, it is like we are all trying to come up with just what the, the, the topics are. Uh, Bryce, this is a very, very, very avant-garde oh. title no, for, no, 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 no. for what we were I, talking it, about. It, to the point that we didn't know. Sure. We didn't know. If, if, beep, beep, okay. kaboom. No, 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 no. This, a this is, is my me. favorite episode of Danger Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> Number one, but I didn't know what the fuck it meant. This is this is one hundred percent on me because while everybody else in this organization has been using the doc, I have not. I just every time I have an errant thought, I say, "Hey Siri, remind me at Tuesday, and I will pick an arbitrary time, eleven forty-two a.m. to talk about blank." And so <laughs> Tuesday, I wake up and I'm like, "Ah, oh, nothing between me and great nights." And then throughout the day, Siri's like. Talk about this. Talk about that <laughs> yeah. the entire way through. Yeah. All, I, all I know is that this is the cutest way you could say that Brian was involved in a car bomb. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, yeah, okay. Well, uh, well. anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, uh, I couldn't call it two cars broke down. That gives us the whole thing. That could, we could do that. Or we could just use beep, beep, kaboom to describe our n personal relationship after this bit. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, first of all, the Jeep died. Had to go. Whoa! The Jeep? The Jeep. The Jeep. Yes. yes, yes. The Jeep died. Yes. How? Uh, of old age at the tender age of nine. What? Oh. Well, the transmission died. Basically, uh, whenever I pressed it on the did, clutch, did, did it, did it go, give you the Jeep wave as it stopped working? Two, <laughs> anyway, two fingers. It, it died saying, duck two you. <laughs> you know about the Jeep ducking thing? No. no. You know about the Jeep ducking? Wait, you don't know about this? You drive also, a Jeep not, and you don't even. He's okay, not on mic. So no, that's, that's, that, conversation that's fine. They're, 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 there are yeah. people here. Sorry. Spoiler. Darren uh, Kitchen, uh, ladies uh, and gentlemen. Uh, but, but, uh, so there's a thing where people are taking rubber ducks and putting them on Jeeps. Like as oh, a little, like, you, you get gotcha. ducked, right? I have one in my car in my Jeep right now. Okay, now, how, how, how does that go socially? When do you decide to duck somebody? Well, I guess that's going to happen to you today. But I, uh, I guess what I'm asking is what the duck <laughs> Uh, I, I was in uh, Arkansas back in November, and I had left the doors open in the Jeep because that's what you do on a soft top. You don't lock the doors. Yep. And I uh, went for a bike ride, and when I came back, there was a duck, a little rubber duck on the uh, – uh, wow, suddenly lights everywhere. But uh, there was a little rubber duck, and on it it says, hey, tweet – we like we think your your Jeep is really cool. Here, have a rubber duck and tweet it and then give it to somebody else when you find the right person. So I haven't found the right person yet. So. Uh, dude, if only I knew somebody who was into Jeeps and rubber ducks. Uh, seems like there would be something there. But the point is, uh, the, uh, <clears throat> the Jeep died. And so I drove Bonnie's uh, giant 1990 uh, Chevy, uh, it's not a Silverado, a Cheyenne, right? Sure. Uh, something so loud, like, uh, like I, I don't know, the, the steering fluid doesn't pipe right. And so every time you turn, it goes. It is, it is a beater. It, yes. Like, like, like if you are hanging out on the property and that vehicle comes through, like, you know it. Oh, yeah. Like, it is, it is rumbling, stumbling, bumbling, clanging, like, like on, onto it. So it's like. For you to be driving it, you know you are at the last rung of of, of your entire family's uh, of driving capacity. That is correct. And now, finally, at the last rung, I finally give a thought to my deuces. 
the, the <laughs> so so I'm driving I'm driving the, the the truck and Friday was a particularly good day. I got up early. Uh, I went and took a COVID test because. Uh, and then uh, I was driving. Back. Oh, my, that was a fun. That was a fun text message to get. I got a text message on Friday morning that said just in a block. Right. Not in parts like not just a gigantic journey that I got to go on. Hey, guys, to me and Bryce. Hey, guys, I took a covid test. I'd been coughing a lot and I just felt that I really needed to take one. Anyway, it's negative. <laughs> well, I, 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 and then and then. I'm gonna get a bunch of these tests for the for here so that we just have a bunch of them. I haven't seen yeah, 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 yeah. What beep, beep, kaboom, like, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> beep, beep, kaboom. What about this is not a good idea? It's, it's great. I would love to see one like, of these tests. There's just like, a lot going on in that in that one thing. Uh, the patrons heard the episode that we recorded on Thursday, and I was aware that I had a tickle in my throat, and I was coughing a lot. And then I don't I, remember you coughing a lot. Oh, boy. I, I don't either. The patrons. Oh. Uh, pray to Dean Kane, <laughs> but the uh, but but uh, so so I share that and, and so anyway I I grab uh, and I ain't done this in a dog's age. I go to to Jim's, which is like a, a I don't know your Denny's, the low diner. budget Denny's or yeah, I hop yeah. type yeah, thing diner yeah yeah family full, diner full on have the pancakes and the hash browns and all that stuff. I'm like woo, this is great. I got up early and and so I'm driving back. <laughs> Why are you reacting this? Way? I just love the idea of you. Sitting at the bar at, at that I little took diner a bar. Of it. At I, the diner yeah. bar. No, 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 no. I don't need the picture. I just need the mental image of you getting slid your breakfast and going, Woo, <laughs> this is great. <laughs> it's shockingly close to what happened. I, I don't doubt it. I've had breakfast there. It's great. So I'm driving back. Woo! I'm like, <laughs> Woo! No, I had a poor night's sleep. So I'm just thinking, like, just make it on home, take a little two hour nap. It's going to be great. I, I don't have COVID. I ate a pan. Pancake. Let's just go on yep. home. Uh, so from Jim's is where you're coming yes, from. Yes, correct. So yeah. so it's around nine a.m., nine thirty ish or whatever. And then all and, of a sudden, I, and I would guess that's what three miles, four miles to your house from Jim. I think it's six. Six. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So uh, uh, halfway at the three mile mark, uh, all of a sudden the car just stops going sixty and starts going fifty, and then starts going forty, and no amount of of of, of pedal pushing or yep. turning of things. And so it's like, ooh, I guess I'm going to pull over on the side of the road, pull over on the side of the road, and, uh, and, and, uh, rrr, 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 rrr. nope, nothing, not starting, totally dead. Uh, called AAA. Yep. Hour and a half. Wow. It's going to be an hour and a half that you have to sit. And by the way, for, for, for those who are unaware of, of no AC, uh, 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 Hill Country, Texas, uh, this is not exactly an area where Brian can just fuck off to a random bar. No. Uh, but it is a place I can sit there because at 930, the temperature is 92 degrees. Mm -hmm. mm. So I can sit there as the temperature climbs yes. <clears throat> on the side of the road. <clears throat> and I think to myself, like, okay, look, let's, let's make lemonade out of lemons. I'm trying to think of a metaphor. <laughs> Lemons. <laughs> Classics for a reason. <laughs> Lemons. It's already a yeah, metaphor. It's already there. It's it's already I'll take your word for it. <laughs> trying to think of a metaphor. <laughs> <laughs> Try to make lemonade out of a metaphor. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I have this thought. I'm trying to give a genuine account. I know. Here. Go. <laughs> I have this thought about about uh, about how it's like a. Man, uh, well, what are some things uh, I could do right now? And uh, for some reason, uh, I was I was thinking about um, how many times we've referenced Billy Joel, and you know whether it was Milk Leg or, yeah. or, or the, the the porno Billy Joel stuff that we did. We we consistently come back to trying to figure out ways that we can joke about Billy Joel songs. And and I'm so annoyed, and I'm so pent up, and I'm so deltaed out, and all that stuff that I'm yeah. like, I have the thought. Oh my God! You know what? Fuck everything. Let's me let let me let me let me let me withdraw funds from my kids' college fund so that Justin and I could go to Madison Square Garden where Billy Joel has a residency and 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 good God, at least we'll see Billy Joel before we die. I don't know why that that popped into my head oh. at this moment, right? So I go for the I record. <laughs> only twenty minutes prior, you were like. Woo, pancakes. Pancakes. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> and now you're like, fuck life. <laughs> life is worthless. 
<laughs> we are all looking into the void. I don't give a <laughs> shit about anything. I'm taking all my money out. We are going to see the piano man where we where we he should be seen. In the garden, baby. <laughs> the garden, baby. Uh, the, uh, that is where my headspace is at. Yeah. And I'm just so fired up. I'm like, I fucking, 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 whatever. And then I type in, I go to Google, angrily baking yeah. and now 95 degree heat at 1030 in the morning. And I type in Billy Joel tickets in the most angry clickety clack uh. way. And then the first thing that pops up, it says Billy Joel tour schedule. Uh, first, Madison Square Garden. I'm like, well, that's probably the... And then my thumb pauses, and it says, second, Austin, Texas. <laughs> and then I look, and he's playing at the Circuit of the Americas right here in Austin, Texas, right in October. We're going to go see. Uh, I, I definitely text Justin and say, I just hope he plays Milk Leg. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, that, that uh, yeah, that's the that's the moral of that story. When uh, October twenty third here in Austin, Are tickets get, already sold. I mean, uh, tickets, uh, baby. Uh, I, I, this is this is what we need to organize because if I'm I'm thinking like if you guys want to see if you have ever in your entire fucking life wanted to go to a Billy Joel concert and not watch Billy Joel, but instead watch your two favorite internet comedians do parodies of Billy Joel <laughs> in front of his own fucking concerts, boy, do we have a night of excitement for you. So you're booking us to do our own parodies of Fuck his song. Yes, and like, then we'll sell with, it as a pay-per-view special. With, 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 with our back to Billy Joel the entire time <laughs> as we're performing for our audience. Check out my leg. It's made of milk. The other leg is a milk leg of milk. I, mean, I stole a bunch of money and then I tilked. That's not a real <laughs> word. But anyway, this is fun. <laughs> ba, ba, da, 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 da. So is that what the Milk Lake song is? That? Is that what you're saying? You're going to Rocky Horror it. Uh, I, look, I, we I, would I, love I, if everybody came out and saw Billy Joel with us because he's Because Billy we Joel. need the tickets. It's, it's <laughs> we don't know how to get them. And we, we don't, don't know, know how to make it happen. Uh, uh, no, that was, that was a delightful thing. In fact, it ties into another one of our stories. Bryce! Uh, wait, Maybe I know this does? one. Spaceship a dip. <laughs> what? It was it was the like, like beep, boom, beep, beep beep. You're fucked yeah. or whatever your last time was. <laughs> I I don't Dean know what I'm Kane supposed to. Help I don't know what I'm. No, I don't know what no, I'm supposed go, to. Go, to. Next go 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 next, next story. Time. DMV pro tips. Oh, shit. I ain't been to the DMV in a hot minute. I this is really not even a good story. This is just me. Uh, we we eventually had to get our our car registered and we had to get our driver's licenses. So this, we carved out license our entire plates or yeah plates and the car. and our and our cards. We tried to do both of them on the same. So you had to do a whole journey to whole, the whole whole journey. Yeah, the bureaucracy. So, so I don't even know how how, how how interesting it is. I mean, it's just like you know, just I don't know some like tips of what we did, but. Uh, so, so uh, I'm sorry. Uh, this is just pro tips for what you did. No, no, wait, well, hold, hold on. Well, but, I mean, but, but it went, it went well. The rest of it was well. Yeah, no. So we got our we got our IDs and we okay. got our uh, and we got our our, our plates. To yeah. be honest, we have uh, recent emigres, uh, 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 immigrants, uh, people who have immigrants, <laughs> uh -huh. like aliens, <laughs> migrants, some immigrants. We have migrant workers oh, here. God. I mean, <laughs> man. <laughs> okay. Do we? Point is, we have uh, we have uh, transplants. Is that what you call them? I, Expats. I don't know, I don't what, know what people we're talking about. People who have come to Texas from other places. Yeah, there there's right. a I lot of them. Understand. We have them in the <laughs> audience. It seems like we could give them some DMV. If you have tips, I want I want just a tip. Well, sure. I mean, I, I just don't know if they're like that big of a deal. We can get through them real quick. Uh, let's try this. Hold on. <clears throat> maybe, maybe. Uh, uh, what's that bit from uh, uh, the Goose Suits? <laughs> Little Buff Boys. <laughs> well, let's let's put yeah. on a Goose Suit here. Okay. Uh, okay. <clears throat> I mean, uh, Bre Bryce. I don't think uh, it's worthwhile for. Let me introduce. I, I I understand that you don't believe this is worth a lot. But it could be a big deal to oh, somebody else. Okay. You just got to right. goose Whatever. up. Whatever. Go, 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 okay. go, go. All right. Go, go, go. <clears throat> All right. Here we go. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, 
presenting the most important thing on the internet since the world's worst dog ride. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Jerry's Red Tap DMV Timmy! Right? Okay. All right. Oh. <clears throat> Chip number one. Um, don't don't go to the tax collector drive-through because for new residents they won't do it through the drive-through. So you just go to a private place called Celtex, and they'll take care of it for only twenty nine dollars more. <laughs> I don't think this is working. Oh, like, no, no, I, no. I, I, I think I, it's going great. I, 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 I think, so, so I mean, these the, are the, not really good tips. Well, like these are just things I did last Friday. Well, no, no, no. But 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 don't go through the drive-through because you can't. Something about Centex or they have they have they have pneumatic tubes and they so have they, tubes. Yeah, and so they can't put the 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 things back in the the so license no, plate drive through and, 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 and so i waited there for an hour and a half and then they told me once i got there but again this is just me bitching about a thing that i did at the tax collectors on no, friday no this is we're already like way past the time look, that the i expected next, look, for this segment. you do realize elon musk is going to move here he's probably watching this right now yep are you just gonna throw this shit away jeff bezos is gonna show up way late in a slower vehicle after <laughs> Elon Musk shows up and they need to know this shit. I mean, Richard Branson is busy fucking. Yeah, <laughs> well, of course he is. <laughs> it's an evergreen thing. <laughs> that, could just, that could be said I, after more, every... More like, more like evercream, am I right? Oh. That oh. could be said after every sentence ever said in the English language. Let me to make... be or not to be. <laughs> and Richard Branson's <laughs> fucking. <Still> fucking. <laughs> Actually, let me let me make a note on Siri. All right, all right. Uh, so, so first one, uh, drive through is bullshit, right? At the tax collector, yeah, sure. At the tax collector, yes. And then I went to a place called Celtex, C E L T E X. Big shout out to them, but they took care of everything in like the record time for so, a, a so, small fee. Uh, only the one tip. No, I, I mean. You go, you go, okay, look, if you have a second tip, I feel like we're wasting everybody's no, time. No, no, except for Elon Musk. <laughs> Uh, uh, if you have another tip, refuse to make eye contact. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's refusing! Yeah, okay, he's all right. Refusing. You know what that means? Tip, 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 tip. Pro tip. DMV Pro tip. Pro tip number two. That means a deuce. That means I don't think of it more than his children. <laughs> if you're. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> you're in Austin. You don't have to go to an Austin DMV to get your license. All you <laughs> wait, let him finish the tip. Just pull up a zip code map of Central Texas and start typing in <laughs> random zip codes, and we found an appointment for the same day in Gonzales, Texas, less than an hour away. And we both, me and my wife, got our IDs. Holy fuck! <laughs> That's it. Two tips. <laughs> it is it. That's it. <laughs> All right, Bryce. What else you got for us? That's it. No, we're done. Okay, we're all done. Right. We're done. Ladies right. and gentlemen, you were right. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, no, patreon.com no, no. slash great, uh, great night is where you go. I keep expecting the fucking music. <laughs> And the lights. Uh, uh, Patreon.com slash uh, 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 Great Night is where you go. Uh, uh, thank you to everybody. Uh, uh, Brian, you literally just did like an audit of your like entire operation and found that like if there's one thing that not only has remained strong for years and years and years, but right now you guys are responding to this content in a way that you have not since the very beginning. 
of our our, our, our Patreon. Yeah, and, it is and, and, and it is th- your support for great. This is sort of a, a, a no bullshit moment. Uh, like like um, uh, of course there's excitement when somebody leaves the network, it goes independent, and of course there's ups and downs over the years. But right now we are 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 at a peak, and I I'm so curious. And as a matter of fact, everybody at Patreon.com/slash/GreatNight, if you joined us in our post network incarnation. Yeah. I would love to hear about it and what drew you all the way in into actually supporting this. And before you say it, we all know it's the DMV tips. But <laughs> what you. else have you enjoyed? Patreon.com slash great night. Uh, and by the way, when you are a patron, you get an exclusive episode each and every week. And- uh, a bonus episode. This episode is going to be a pretty good one. It'll be a special. You, you want to tease This it? coming week? You want to tease it? Uh, uh, I... I uh, uh, it'll be it'll be personal. You we don't we don't want to say. Well, I don't know that the guest. I think he did not book. 100%. I think he did not finish <laughs> booking it in the hour since we last talked. But about but, it. but 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 if not that guest, then I I do have something else that, you that got, is very you got, you got deeply personal. Uh, yeah, obviously. Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. there we go, uh, guys. Uh, uh, exclusive episodes right here at patreoncom slash night. We got a game, Bryce. Uh, yes, hello, we do have a game. Hello, everybody. Uh, I, I thought we would dig up one of our old favorites. Say it with me. It's the Would You Rather Buy! Would You Rather Buy! So there's a... Uh, uh, thank you very much. Applause. Uh, the, there's a website There's a website on the internet called Twitter.com, and if you go there, there's a, <laughs> <laughs> there's a guy there who... Tell us more. <laughs> There's, yeah. an, there's an account on Twitter called WYR underscore bot. And Whip it to Whip it for us. Called WYR bot. Uh, every, I don't know, 15 minutes or so, it, it generates um, a, an either or would you rather given some, uh, some random uh, variables. So, like one they're running right now is would you rather frozen donuts hot? <laughs> Or juice of cookies. <laughs> so this would be the type of thing that we would pose it to one of now, the guys. Uh, 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 we have we have done games with the Would You Rather bot for for years now, uh, but this is the first time we've done it on Great Night. Yeah, yeah, hundred mm-hmm. percent. That's right. Oh, which means if it's a game, there has to be some consequences. <laughs> mm, what do we got? Well, uh, I had a really good one, but then we're going to wait until May for that one. Oh but uh, <laughs> pre-show, guys, got to watch get, the pre-show. Get, get that green room. Uh, uh, there may or may not be uh, Mayo Month. Uh, I'm going to uh, uh, thank uh, Kyle Wells, who wrote in to uh, uh, greatnightpod at gmail.com. Everybody should be doing that to help the consequence master, which is me. Uh, uh, figure out some consequences. We're going to do a lame one tonight. It's just a straight up lame one. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> wow. You know, uh, <laughs> a lot of build up for this. Yeah. <laughs> build up tips. You get yeah. To, uh, you got I, 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 I was going to say, I didn't know that we were looking at the antonym for the world's greatest showman. <laughs> yes. <that's right. laughs> oh. I mean, it's no big deal. Ladies and gentlemen, step right up. <laughs> Normal things are going to happen. Disappointing things Zero that you have probably eight. already seen. Oh, uh, guys. Oh, shucks. I don't know. He calls himself Hulk Hogan. He calls yeah. himself some kind of giant. Who cares? He might have called <laughs> <laughs> one, this guy named Dwayne called himself The Rock, whatever. Yeah. Uh, so uh, one of you will tweet mm. that you love your mother-in-law, the loser. Oh, my God, we admit it? Oh, my God, you admit it! Whoa, admit we have to it. Marry. Okay, all right. <laughs> Stinky. I do love my mother-in-law. I'll never admit I love, it. I Not love, on Twitter. Uh, yeah. you, you love my mother-in-law. <laughs> I do love your mother-in-law. Right? I love your mother-in-law. Yeah. Why don't you marry her? <laughs> and now you have to marry my mother-in-law. You do, because you said she it. Played, you gotta do it. Played. You gotta do it now, man. All right. What do we play? Or I guess. Yeah. Let's let's begin. That's right. So I'll give you I'll give you a would you rather. You're gonna tell me uh, which you would rather, and if that is what the internet at large uh, said, then you'll get a point. Easy enough. Yeah. Yep. All right, Justin. We're gonna start with you on this one. Would you rather be an Olympian? Hmm. Or be a dragon. Oh. Now, uh, for, for people who are just listening, we are guessing what the internet answered, right? Uh, yep. Yes. 
be an Olympian or be a dragon. Right. I think that's easy. It's like been jillions of Olympians. Only only a whole lot of dragons of dragon. rolling around. I think people want to be the exclusive, scaly, fire-breathing dragon. A.K.A. virgin. Because if there's one thing every <laughs> Olympian is not, it is a virgin. <laughs> They're all getting laid in that Olympic village by, by a bull who claims to be Zeus. <laughs> <laughs> He was hairy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I... I, I, I Sorry. <laughs> no, leave it. No, leave it. Good. Let it let it sit. Let it sit. It yeah. deserves to still. That's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> What's the fucking answer, Bryce? Your answer of a dragon is Correct. 72.4% said they would be a dragon. Uh, That's a yeah. point. Nerds. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, because like when I getting fucked by a bull has a whole different context yeah. in the modern era. <laughs> All right, Brian, we got one for you here. Ready. Would you rather the most extremely intelligent or be dumb but not die? <laughs> Uh, this is, this is a good one. I mean, I already took this bargain. I already met with this genie. Uh, <laughs> so, so you would be die. either very, very smart. <laughs> yeah. But you'd die uh, or you'd be very be dumb yeah. and you would live forever. Yeah. Was there so a like question? Brad Pitt in the uh, interview with a vampire. Uh, uh, what's funny is I wanted to do a whole bit where I didn't understand the question, but then <laughs> figured out that I was going to live forever. Uh, no, no, no. I, I, I think the answer is, uh, be very smart. You're gonna say be extremely. The, uh, Wait, you, so using the, the internet, most will, intelligent. Twitter would give up immortality. I think Twitter knows that all of their tweets are already dumb, and they already will live forever. <laughs> and we all want what we do not have. Fair point. Here we go. Your answer of the most extremely intelligent is. With 64.5%, the most extremely intelligent. Oh! I got fucked by a bull. You should have well. gotten excited as soon as you heard 65% because it had to be right. Well, I, I mean, how would I know? I'm going to live forever. <laughs> <laughs> And also, I might have been talking about the other choice. <laughs> All right, Justin, we got one for you here. Would you rather? Hey, thank you to 40% of the audience. <laughs> Would you rather heck or <laughs> no? Can I see on? Oh, oh, can you use it can, in a can, sentence? Can, can you can you show me what they are spelled like? Because this one, I feel like if we if we are borderline onomatopoeia, I kind of need to understand the construction of this. Absolutely. Here we go. Pull this up right here. How we go? Would you rather heck with one exclamation mark or no? And by the way, for those audio listeners, it is no with, it looks like five exclamation points and, and one quest question mark but, but, at the end. But the question mark, I believe, is algorithmically generated because it's a would you oh. rather blank or blank. Yes, that's right. That oh. Would you rather oh. heck or no? Oh, gotcha, gotcha. I can explain I like this to you because I'm going to live forever. <laughs> no. Just, are you going to do heck or no? I feel like it's a very Twitter answer to say no. I feel like if you really broke down 90% of all tweets, they are some version of no. Uh, counterpoint, as your advisor, as sure. somebody who wants you to win, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, uh, it could be like no, 50% of the time means you don't get to do a thing. How many times are you like, heck? Like that could be either way. That could be good or bad. Like, hey man, you want to meet? Clifford's big red <laughs> heck. Hey, enjoy eternity, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going with uh, I'm going with no. You're gonna go with no. All right. The correct answer with 68.9% of the vote was Heck! Oh! Incorrect. Oh, we're oh, all for Justin. <laughs> oh, somebody loves my mother-in-law. All right, all right, all right. I have a good steer, right. good transmission that doesn't give out <laughs> on <laughs> Billy Joel concert. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Brian, this one's for you. Ready. Would you, uh, oh, here we go. Would you rather only be able to laugh or 
never be able to laugh again. <laughs> Would you right, rather right. only be able to uh, laugh uh, or never be uh, able to uh, laugh man. again? Mm. Mm. These boots sound awesome. <laughs> no. I'd rather laugh forever, forever and ever and ever. All right, I'll it's, it takes, Bryce, it takes Bryce, me. Bryce gets bonus points for having that music ready to go. <laughs> All right. Uh, so you you said you would only you rather only be able to laugh. Yeah. Okay. So wait, then wait, never wait. laugh forever. No, uh, but you can't. Yeah, talk. Wait, you can't talk anymore. You're only laughing. You can't do this show. You're just laughing. I now have. Think about I, it. I mean, no, 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 hold on. I was about to say. <laughs> I have the world's most infectious laugh. But you can't speak. You can't talk I don't to your got wife it. anymore. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. <laughs> give me, all right. You can't talk to right, your children. Right, hold on. Do it. Okay. Let's try to I roll, I roll up. To, all right, give me a situation. Any situation. Okay, Any you are situation. giving a speech at your daughter's wedding. <clears throat> <laughs> oh. Uh, you are, you wow. are, you wow. are uh, 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 reading the will for one of your parents. Uh. <laughs> 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 All right. And now you are delivering the address. The State of the Union as president <laughs> where you are surrendering the nation to Russia. <laughs> All right. Uh, he fucking pulled it off, yeah, everybody. He pulled it off. He pulled, he it, pulled it, off. it off. He pulled it off. <laughs> Holy shit. I didn't think it was possible. It was fucking possible. Oh, my God. I would like to believe that the internet agrees because it would suck to do all that and lose the points. <laughs> <laughs> okay, your answer was uh, uh, one last time, only be able to laugh. Yeah. Yes. The correct answer with 52.8% of the vote is... Never be able to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Now, Joe, let me tell you something. <laughs> I understand you and I diverged in our paths. I decided to never laugh again. But you became president, and look what happened in Afghanistan. All right, next question, Bryce. Okay. Um, uh, all right, here's one for you. This is Justin's turn. Justin. Yeah. Would you rather... Know everything that any human has known, or oh Christ, everything that no other human has known. Hold on, uh, hold on, hold on. Question. Yeah. Which one? Honestly, and this is a true question. Okay. Which one would give you detailed knowledge of the most buttholes? I the think most buttholes. Right. Uh, I guess. Re it would re re I re repeat the question through that lens. Yeah. <laughs> All right, sure. It's a well, well, I mean, well, well, number one, you haven't seen White Lotus. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the question, would you rather know? I don't need to. I'm old POTUS. <laughs> Which, <laughs> that's, that none of that plays. That's so you're mixing shows, mixing <laughs> networks. All right, would you rather know everything that any human has known or everything that no other human has known? This is for Justin. Uh, yeah, I mean, I think it, it's, it's, so basically you can live the life you're living right now and know infinite secrets, or you could be burdened with the current knowledge of the universe. Everything that nobody knows. Yeah. No, 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 no. I, I'm saying everything that nobody knows means that now you, you have, you have 
infinite knowledge that you can exploit. If you're only knowing things that everybody knows, then I don't know. You have common conversation at dinner parties. Yeah, but you're not <clears throat> adding anything to society at all. Because you're saying In something which one? that other people know? <clears throat> oh, no, wait. I guess, yeah, no, you're not adding anything to society because you're, you're, you're dipping from that reservoir that's already been established. Whereas yeah. the other one, it's like... Yeah, no, no I'm, I'm saying nobody. Like, no, right. Nobody's okay. the way I would go, yeah. But that means you have to know about the galaxy where uh, infinite Hitler's cured infinite AIDS and, and yeah. be cool with that. Sure. Cool. I'm going to bring that up at an Arby's. I mean, if I still had the ability I'm, to I'm laugh, just, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna drop that shit on people randomly. I mean, I'll just be like halfway through my big Montana, and I'll have like a bunch of fucking sauce dripping down my yep. my chin because yep. I, I, this one is gonna be old hat. I mean, like, oh yeah. Mm. Mm. By the way, you know, infinite Hitler's <laughs> cured mm. infinite AIDS. <laughs> Can you pass my Sprite? <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's you. All right, yeah. cool. All right, so that's what I'm going to do. Let's see if it's Twitter. Yeah. All right, so, but, uh, uh, excuse me, sorry. Which one did you, you want to know? No one. The, I want to know the shit that nobody knows. Everything that no other human yeah. has. I mean, I'll show you my butthole. We know. <laughs> Someone knows. We've that. all seen this. Go, all right, get that. the music going. Get the music <laughs> going. <laughs> all right. Uh... Uh, da, 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 da. The winning poll selection with 62.3% of the vote is bum, bum, bum. everything that no other human has hey, known. Uh, uh, just uh, uh, <laughs> that's a weird mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Watch White Lotus. Watch White Lotus. A lot of buttholes in White Lotus. Yeah. <laughs> You're going to see Steve Zahn's dick. You do first episode, like <laughs> in the pilot. <laughs> the first one. All right, here's one. Uh, hey, I'll, hold on one second. Okay. Do you? Think yeah, that thing you do. Steve's on <laughs> his dick. Do, uh, do, do you think we would get? Uh, okay, there there was in the mid '90s a radio ad that said radio ads are better than TV ads. Yeah. In TV ads, if we wanted you to buy our beer, we couldn't show you a naked woman, but here on the radio. We can tell you there's a naked woman holding our beer by our beer, right? <clears throat> how much of that could we get away with on Twitch before they kicked us off? With how talking? much of a naked woman could we show yeah. on Twitch? How much of a graphic description of pornographies could we get away with before we get kicked off? Dude, would you like to put a kiddie pool on the studio Jesus floor? Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> I'll never laugh again. <laughs> uh, seems like a bad omen for this show. Brian, yes. yep. uh, we got one for you here. Would you rather forget the past or never go back? Ne never go back? Never go back. Would you rather forget the past or never go back? This is a Big situation one. I never expected to this encounter. This is a Billy Joel lyric. <laughs> Would you rather forget the past or never go back? I mean, I'm living both of these. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't I'm know living I... both of these. <laughs> and they I break don't... to my knees. No, you have to keep uh, uh, talking uh, normal. Uh, uh, <laughs> That's how I'm getting the lyrics. Oh, okay. <laughs> both of these. <clears throat> both of these. And I don't know which is better. And I don't know which <laughs> is better. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder where I'll be. Where I'll be? October twenty third. October twenty third. In Austin, Texas. In Austin, Texas. Come get tickets to my show. I'm Billy Joel. There's a naked lady holding my tickets on the radio. <laughs> Oh, she's fucking the tickets now. Oh she's my goodness. She's fucking oh, the tickets now. And she doesn't even know how. <laughs> they let there you talk about this? There is the ticket line. <laughs> it's the real ticket crime here. Billy Joel's radio ad. Started with Brian. Now it's gone past that. Billy Joel. Told you, we just love doing Billy Joel's thing. <laughs> I would say, I would say, never, <laughs> never go back. <laughs> so your answer is, you would rather never go back than forget the past. Never go back. <laughs> now that sounds like, I'll never go back. I'll never go back. Don't lie to the audience. <laughs> All right. A never go back got... 
70.5%. Yeah! Mm. All right. After three rounds of play, Brett, tell us where uh, we're at. I'm pretty sure I'm correct in this. That uh, <laughs> We hope so. Justin, <laughs> you have two points. Uh, mm -hmm. Brian, <laughs> uh -oh. you have two points. God damn it. You're doing good. You're tired. You're doing good. 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 Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, hold on. Is it wait, 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 mean that Brian is never it just me who heard him slide in? <laughs> you're doing good. I mean, you're tired, but you're doing good. <laughs> <laughs> is that like how many situations do you get away with that? I'm tired. You know, it's it's like you're, you're at Chick Fil A, and they're all like, "Hi, what's your name?" You know, like, number two, no pickle. Uh, just some stupid, like, "Hey, you're doing good." Oh, they go, "You're tired." <laughs> you're tired. Doing good. Oh, you're we're tired. tired. <laughs> oh no, sorry. Did that you was really? that was Come just on. Brian's inner monologue. <laughs> I just love the idea of just You're doing sliding great. that one You're in. You're tired. <laughs> mm. You say you say it to to uh, Dale Earnhardt Jr. <laughs> You're doing good, but you're oh, tired. tired. Is that because his dad died? Oh, he's tired because he's been racing for eight hours straight. Oh, you would know this if you had given up the ability to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> chosen to live forever like me. All right, Justin, I'm going to would you rather for you. didn't know that his dad died. Sorry. <laughs> Justin, would you rather <laughs> have spaghetti mm. or eat lasagna? Oh! The classic I've have spaghetti and eat lasagna too. Oh. If I was willing to have revealed my ethnicity, I'd be very excited. <laughs> <laughs> ring, 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 uh, ring. Oh, hello. Yeah, this is Hitler. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> What do you do? What if Hitler calls you? If Hitler for real calls you on the phone, what the fuck do you do? Do you call nine one one? I did. Yeah. Hold on. No. Hello, nine one one. Yeah, this is Hitler. Oh, oh, God God. Damn it. Infinite Hitlers. Oh no. God damn. Good thing about oh. that. Infinite AIDS, though. All right, Justin, would you rather have spaghetti or I was lasagna? trying to. He hangs up. He turns and he goes. He goes like, "I am sorry, fellow Hitlers. I tried to tell them about wow. the cure for AIDS." <laughs> this summer from Jordan Peele. <laughs> <laughs> All right, J-Man, would you rather have spaghetti or eat lasagna? Ooh, I think spaghetti, if we're literally going spaghetti or lasagna, I feel but, like spaghetti is a more popular dish. Okay, real quick, just throwing this out there. Your opinion <laughs> on Mondays. Oh, my God. I was just going to say it. <laughs> it's like we looked at each other and we both realized it was like, am I willing to cut off your Garfield joke? <laughs> or let you go? Am I going to let him yeah. do it? Yeah, all right. Uh, uh, yeah, no, I, I, my thought was, what if this poll was only answered by Garfield? <laughs> you don't know if only Garfield's answered this poll. That's a good point. Uh, no, uh, Jim spaghetti. Davis, like, spaghetti. Spaghetti. <laughs> he's got, he's got, seven, he's got 75,000 sock puppet accounts. He's like, I swear to God, <laughs> would you rather buy? How much of Garfield <laughs> is autobiographical for Jim Davis? Uh, oh, uh, uh, about uh, yes, except for he's Liz. <laughs> he's right. what? He's Liz. We're, we're no, deep into the None of y'all know. Yeah, yeah. Fuck you and your lack of knowledge of Garfield lore. <laughs> but you also, Why would we? You, I chose to never laugh again, so I could bring this information <laughs> oh. to you. You're also very quiet. We couldn't hear you. All right. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, spaghetti or spaghetti, lasagna? Spaghetti. 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 All right. Spaghetti got 38%. Oh. Oh. What? Oh. Lasagna is more popular than spaghetti on the internet? This must have been taken on a Monday. And also, you can eat the lasagna. Someone, you could read this as... Wait, would you rather... Oh, oh, hello? Hey, it's Liz from the comic strip Garfield. Who? Fuck you! <laughs> Click. Hitler again. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Brian, here's one for you. Ready. Would you rather 
have an art class mm. or a musical instruments lesson? <laughs> yeah. So, so, uh, mm. Would you rather have an art class or a musical instruments lesson? Isn't that like saying, would you rather have 100% of this circle or 30% of the same circle? Well, like, we could just... Let's assume it's like a school art class. It's yeah. a very traditional painting. Let's assume it's a school. <laughs> I mean, it's art, be, m- music, music musical separate. instrument. That's what uh, everybody loved. Uh, uh, this one goes out to the Rolling Stone himself, Jim Davis. Jim Davis. <laughs> yeah. Jim Davis. Garfield. Jim Davis. Creator of Garfield. Yeah. Uh, all right. Musical Maybe, instruments. Musical instruments, I see. All right. Turns out Charlie Watts loved Mondays because he lived during it. <laughs> All right. With 50.3% of the vote, the winning option was have an art class. That's a no-go. Wow. Close one, though. Sleeping on the couch tonight. (laughs) Yep. (laughs) Yep. (laughs) Because you did bad in the game? No, because my wife is a artist. Uh, (laughs) I know how I would have answered. <laughs> like which one's closer to voice acting? <laughs> yeah, no, it would have been an art class. Yeah, uh, I see. Uh, all right, uh, Justin, here we go. Let's 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 go through these here. Would you rather spaghetti <laughs> on oh, fire fuck. pizza? <laughs> well, now, I'll say it again. Would you rather spaghetti on fire pizza? Also, spaghetti as a verb. Put a pin in that. Yeah. Or fire pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hold on, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> I, 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 uh, 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 may I propose that this one is straight up for all the marbles. We could discuss it out, and, and if you get it right, you win the whole game. There. All right. All right. What does to spaghetti mean? So if you're spaghettiing, yeah. I mean, all right, yeah. <laughs> just uh, we're talking we are, ropes of this shit. <laughs> we are taking this seriously, right? Oh yes, very right. Uh, very serious. <laughs> <laughs> so serious. Your, your game partner Dracula really wants you to win. <laughs> <laughs> so Who would you like a pizza pie? <laughs> oh my mother! <laughs> Mamma mia! Okay, so serious. To spaghetti. All right. So yes. the biggest thing that you would refer to with spaghetti would oh be to God. throw it against the wall, right? You, you, throw, you, 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 you throw spaghetti against the wall. Ooh, I don't know about that. And you see what sticks. That's the metaphor. That's, that's, the, oh, that's the, the most that's popular the big, metaphor, the, the, right? The, oh, you, by biggest, you mean the most popular, not yeah. the, the literal biggest. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> are you are you gonna you know, pull the Clifford out or what? Uh, no, I mean, I, yeah, yeah, some galaxy shoots ropes into a black hole. Don't worry about. It. Are you talking about cub? <laughs> No, I'm talking about, talking about come here. No, I'm talking, talking about, about big ropes. <laughs> <laughs> Clifford the big red rope. <laughs> talking talk, talk about talking about jizz. Yeah, yeah. no, I go. Whoa, whoa. Talking about semen. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> talking about big shots. <laughs> you had to be a big shot, didn't you? I had to make it up. Okay, all right. Uh, <laughs> uh, one more time, the question: Would you rather spaghetti <laughs> on fire pizza or fire pizza? It's got to be. So I'm assuming they mean like a like like a brick oven fire fire pizza, pizza. Yeah. yeah 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 but so, not so would you rather on that with fire spaghetti on it or oh, just spaghetti that? yeah but I, I in reading it I almost think that it's spaghetti on fire pizza like as in a pizza on fire or just a fire pizza uh, that I would imagine to be that brick oven well, kind of thing okay so so take out the fact that fire is a verb and it's just like would you like spaghetti on toast or toast that's the way I'm reading it. So wait, so you think it, it's spaghetti? Wait, wait, wait. it's on I, fire. I, I do like this new. No, 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 no. She thought. She thought. All right. So, uh, uh, I would say it's going to be fire pizza. I think that the first one is too confusing. Huh. Okay. I hope. What, what do you think? Uh, you think it's the other? I think that there's a fifty percent chance I don't have to tweet about my mother-in-law. <laughs> Bryce. All right, so this is, is it. Are, so are, are, just to are, confirm, are, are, are we agreeing? Answers. This is for all, 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 all the marbles right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what is your answer, Justin? My answer is fire pizza. Your answer is fire pizza, and that's that's giving Brian spaghetti on fire pizza. Yep, for all the marbles. 
The winning choice in this poll with 62% of the vote is... Fire Pizza! Fire! Throw the lights on! Mother-in-law! 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 At the DMV. All right. All right. Wait, go, uh, uh, everybody she's, go. she's not on Twitter, so she'll never hear my proposal. Thank goodness. Twitter.com. Unfortunately, slash... her dad is on Twitter. He's going to kick my ass. <laughs> slash wood. Uh, uh, number one, uh, thank you to uh, everybody who uh, comes up with our games. Bryce, if, if people want to send in games, where can they do it? Yeah, you can uh, email it to us. We have an email for Great Night Now, greatnightpod at gmail.com. You can send an idea for a game, an idea for a punishment. If you want to respond to an episode, if you got some high thoughts, all sorts of that stuff, greatnightpod at gmail.com. <laughs> I, I love the idea that somebody is seeing the show for the very first time. What a hard left turn. <laughs> like, if you've got stuff for the show, stuff for the show, stuff for the show, high thoughts. <laughs> they just figure hit it us, out. They hit us figure up. It figure it out. Out. It's yeah. a self-selecting. Self self it, yeah. Uh, when we first had the idea <laughs> for... <laughs> 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 oh my god, he admitted. All right, I'm gonna retweet that. Go ahead. <laughs> when we first had the idea for uh, a great night and re envisioning the show and having it be a more communal experience, number one, having a live audience was certainly part of the initial vision. This yeah! is the first time we've seen yeah! it. But also, one of the elements that we were never really able to bring to the night attack version of the show was the summer music series. Uh, we have been able to do that now but we've actually taken it further we have had one of our favorite artists show up multiple weeks and continue to perform for us so let's go ahead and welcome jomo from the possum posse back ladies and gentlemen jomo to great night. uh here I, i'll tell you what I'll, t I'll, t I'll take this mic and you you could take the this guy this guy yeah I would, I would have had more words, but I'm going to live forever. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out the, this is how I know I'm going to live forever is because I'm too dumb to find Great Knight's tweet so I can retweet it <laughs> <laughs> because it was a quote tweet. It's, oh, uh, uh, here, you're at uh, Great Knight uh, Live. Right, right, right. Get, yep. get, get a little further in here. So oh, you're, oh, you're, oh, so oh, 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 get in this. Oh, okay. shot. Get on get, it. Oh, get on it. Drama, uh, uh, how was your week? You know, I've had better, but it was pretty great. Is it okay? It was great. One of the best. We were we were really having a conversation about uh, uh some 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 recent closings in South Austin. Yeah, yeah. Recent closings. Uh, Randalls. Oh, oh, dude. Yeah, the Randalls in South Austin. <laughs> <laughs> closing. It's like it's like yeah. How's everything been? Great, great, man. Yeah, but we were talking about you know dogs the other day. Oh, I love dogs. Uh, no, we were talking about a specific dog. You know the one <laughs> that was dying. I oh, don't know what you're oh, talking about. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm so sad. this is the thing I'm sad about? Yeah. Yeah, man, I'm sad about that. Uh, the, the bad thing. This is why we're never going to be professional broadcasters, because I'm trying to do my best to have organic banter, and Brian's like, what the fuck? What the fuck? He didn't know what you were talking about. I was sort of... Asshole! <laughs> I didn't mean I didn't mean it like that. I just really didn't. No, I just, I'm sorry. Uh, I just saw the that uh the South Randall's Mopac uh yeah. you know the right over there, William Cannon and Mopac was closing and I was just been watching all the Afghanistan stuff and wondering if it's gonna be similar or if it's gonna have like as many consequences. Just or I know it's not the same. Yeah. Remember, remember 10 seconds ago when I was the bad guy? <laughs> <laughs> well, Jomo, it's been a pleasure to have you on the show. And no, no, no. Uh, uh, you, you, you got a song for us, and apparently uh, uh, one that uh, uh, involves yeah. uh, my trip to the DMV. Sure. Yeah. I, I had a similar uh, experience. I had to go to the I have. I think you get your license renewed every 10 years. Uh -huh. Otherwise, you could just mail it in. 
Mm. But with COVID, my 10 years was up. They were like, oh, yeah, normally yeah. you have three remaining years, but it's COVID, so fuck you. We're going to just call it. You have to go and renew yours. And so I had to go uh, do that. It All was right. pretty cool. And I wrote a song about it. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. Jomo. Jomo. Yeah. Hey! Bryce, is it coming through? Is the guitar coming through now? Oh, yeah, you're good. All right. <laughs> Well, my wife walked in, said, your license is expired. I said, I didn't even know I had a license. She said, you did, but it expired. Said, you got to get on the computer and make yourself an appointment at the DMV. They don't take walk-ins because COVID. I said, that's fine. Well, Lord have mercy, sakes alive. All I'm doing is trying to drive. Filled out all my forms, paid my fees. And it ain't like me to complain, but this here's taking up my whole day. I'm down here standing in the line at the DMV. First thing they said, you got to get your picture taken. Stand over there by the line, tilt your head down, down, tilt it down more. Now stare with your eyes up at the camera, smile subtly, and click. And they took it. And then they printed it out. I said, man, why would you make me make that face, man? Then you print it out, it looked like a pervert. I was like, that's fine. Well, Lord have mercy, sex alive. All I'm doing is trying to drive. Filling out my forms, paying my fees. And it ain't like me to complain, but this is taking up my whole day. I'm down here standing in the line at the DMV. It should have sounded like this. Yeah. But it didn't. And they said, we got to test your vision. Close your left eye and read this line. I said, A-E-O-R-S. They said, you missed two. I said, which two? They said, E and R. And I said, A-B-O-P-S. They said, you nailed it. Now cover your right eye and read the same line. I said, I got it memorized already. They said, that's fine. Lord, have mercy, sex, life. All I'm doing is trying to drive. I feel that all my phones are pay my fees. And it ain't like me to complain, but this is taking up my whole day. I'm down here standing in a line at the DMV. Down here standing in a line at the DMV. Oh, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Jomo! Oh, thank you. Thank you. So, Shit sucks! Yeah. <laughs> sucks ass! Yeah, that's what they say. Uh, I think I know the question on everyone's mind. What exactly about COVID made you write that song? I don't know, man, uh, but let me show you this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Can we get a close-up? I cover up all my Co details. Yeah, co cover up the good bits. Oh my god. Can you, do it? Yeah. Can you get a close-up? Alright, we're locking in on it. There we go. They're right there, right there, right there. It's perfect. So this isn't Joe's actual <laughs> idea. <laughs> That's not a good photo. It's a bad photo. <laughs> and and they were like like directing you like they were like John Waters like. <laughs> I, was, I, it was a long time. I don't think that's Jomo's face. It was a long time. They were like, I, lower I, with your chin, lower. And now no, look, look, they were, make your eyes go up at the camera. And I, I was like, this feels you, they, you, And then they were like, smile, but not a big smile. Don't show your teeth. Just like, like, like just smile, smile, but with no joy. Okay, so for real, you know, I don't know who you really look like. You really look like, remember when uh, they redid Psycho, but Vince Vaughn? <laughs> yeah. You look like Vince Vaughn trying to do yeah. the, the 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 psycho character. That that was actually one of the weirdest things. Like that that whole psycho thing. I read an article saying that the reason the dude did a shot for shot remake of Psycho was like he was jumping in front of an assassin attacking the president, and he said he said, "Look, they're gonna do. This. Oh my God. They're gonna make this this. Uh, 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 <laughs> they're gonna make this. Put 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 the Vince Vaughn put the Vince Vaughn shit back up." Oh, Christ, there it is. Yeah, that's it. no, that's it. That's <laughs> it. They were trying to recreate that. They were trying to recreate Big that. Big fans. Big the, fans. The article I read said basically, look, somebody's going to try to fuck up Psycho. I'm going to take the bullet. Uh, Gus Van Zandt or some shit. Gus uh, Van Zandt. Yeah, yeah. He was like, I'm just going to, I'm going to pitch him on a shot for shot remake. In other words, exactly Psycho. Only you'll hear him jerking off. And then that was it. That was the only change he made. That and Jello. Jello. Jomo. There's Jello. There's Jello in. Jello. Well, he says Jello instead of whatever 1950s brand. Oh, Those are the only two changes. Oh. Yeah. Wow. No, I I don't think I saw the the remake. Well, that, that was kind that, of the point. I, yeah. I believe. Yeah. yeah. It was it was psycho. Yeah. It was very <laughs> incredibly it was psycho. Thing. It was it was yeah. out there. Yeah. My well, mom I, loved it. 
Yeah. Uh, uh, Jomo, there's one more song that you had for us. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah. Now, this is my first uh, summer in in Texas. Yeah. And I uh, got to say, whew, these temperatures. Yeah, man. We've had a cool summer, I think. Yeah. It's pretty cool, man. Yeah. Well, uh, geez, tell that to my balls because they've been <laughs> sweated off. I mean, I mean, I wrote I wrote a song about what a cool summer it was, and it starts. Uh, yeah. Do, 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 yeah. Go ahead. Keep going. Something or something, karate kid. This is banana rama. Do 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 do. Something and something in Austin. The temperatures down. <laughs> Karate, <laughs> super the best. Sorry, I lost it. No, no. I remember yeah. that song. Wow, it was a hit. Yeah, yeah. It's, it was, it's crazy how they didn't make it cooler summer. In it. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was. It just peters out. Yeah. I, was, I remember that on the radio being like, in. "Why doesn't this song have like a an ending or like yeah, a chorus yeah. or something?" Is this a commercial? Like, yeah, what's going they on? Say and, that and who like is there's this an guy? ice cream parlor or something? Who is this guy? Yeah, no, it's just a song. But I mean, that's just nostalgia that just takes yeah, you back. Yeah, in your head, you yeah. remember that <laughs> was fondly, fun. Was like fun. a golden memory. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. I swear to God, I hope like three people knew where that was headed. I I was with you for just a little bit. Yeah, all right, yeah, you know what? Yeah. Hey, you got a song? <laughs> yeah, I got a song. These, uh, I, swear, they, I swear to God, dude, how great would it be if you just started playing "Cruel Summer"? That would be. Yes, I, I don't know. Yeah, but it'd be, that would it'd be, be an unrealistic expectation rad. that would not set up his performance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll tell you what, that would really rise the heat on old Jomo. Who's going to perform right now? Jomo! Nicely done! Come on, hit that red button on the right. The right or one? Yeah. Well, when I first met you, I felt my temperature rising. Felt my knees go weak, felt my skin go dry. Felt kind of confused, started slurring my speech. You said, somebody help this guy. Really turns out, actually, I was having a heat stroke. It was August in Texas and I was wearing a felt hat But as far as I can see it was the best thing to happen to me If it wasn't for the heat stroke We'd have never had this chat If it wasn't for the heat stroke We'd have never met Well, you told me We were from St. Louis and I said, Barbasol, purple lightning, Illuminati. <laughs> you said, someone get this guy some water. I think he's overheating big time. And I saw your face melt off your head and an alien inside controlling your body. Well, it turns out, actually, I was having a heat stroke. <laughs> it was August in Texas and I was wearing a felt hat. But as far as I can see, it was the best thing to happen to me If it wasn't for the heat stroke We'd have never had this chat If it wasn't for the heat stroke We'd have never met Put me in the car, drove me down to the ER. Turns out heat strokes, they're not great for your health. Ooh, but what we had, it was not a delusion. Unless oh, it was a delusion. <laughs> it turns out actually, yeah, I was just having a heat stroke. It was August in Texas and I was wearing the felt hat But as far as I can see 
It was the best thing to happen to me If it wasn't for the heat stroke We'd never had this chat If it wasn't for the heat stroke We'd never met If it wasn't for the heat stroke I'd have never thought of that Ladies and gentlemen, Jomo of the Possum Posse. Oh, thank you. Where should everybody uh, go? Wait, wait, right hold now? on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, so uh, if you are in the Austin, Texas area, yes. this week, there's only one place where you should be. There's only one place that you need to go in cyberspace, and that is patreon.com slash the Possum Posse. The Possum Posse, yes. because if you are at the $10 level right now, up until Friday, you are going to get the super secret. Invite, uh, invite for a secret, house party. Top secret location in Austin. $10,000. $10,000. Well, that's like if you want to have your own. Suggested. Top don't, I mean, that's yeah, if yeah. you want to have your own second top secret house party just for you. Sure. And we'll, yeah. we'll set up the full band and play just for you sitting there. And it'll be weird. But we, you know, we'll, be, we'll be like, it's worth it. You know what I mean? Because <laughs> you paid us $10,000. But uh, if you just pay ten dollars, you can come to the one. Oh that's my god, you do have a ten thousand dollar tier. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's worth a shot, you know. Yeah, it's, why it not? Could yeah, it could happen. It out there. It sure. Could I mean, yeah. I mean, you know, throw it out there. Drug lords <laughs> listen to country music too. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> uh, but yeah, at the play regular... the one about meth again. <laughs> yeah, and love. Keep it coming. <laughs> and keep it coming. Have one after another. The same song. Yeah, that that's uh, that's another option. But yeah. the, at just the straight ten dollar ten box level, you can come to this. This Patreon party on Friday, we have a house rented. It's going to be rad. We're going to play some music. Then we're going to go out and have some drinks on the town and hang out with people. And, Hells uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'll be there, Brian. Yeah. Uh, when is it? Friday. <laughs> this Friday. Friday. <laughs> I will not be there. I, 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 I'm going to go Florida. Oh, you're in I got, Florida? I got a show. Got a show. Uh, but uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a weird performance art gig where a college said, uh, we want a magician to perform but we want him only if he truly wishes in his heart <laughs> that he was back home watching a music show. Uh, and I those, almost uh, didn't get the gig. One of those gigs. Yeah, but luckily, uh, luckily we're I square mean, now. Yeah. I'd say that works perfectly. I'd say yeah. that works out perfectly. Mm. Glad to help. Uh, <laughs> hey, Brett, uh, uh, you were watching the whole damn thing. Did, did we learn anything? Uh, yes, uh, we learned about uh, big ropes of spaghetti going <laughs> into uh, black holes. Uh, yeah. We learned that you should never, ever wear a felt hat in August in Austin. That's true. Uh, we learned that uh, that the DMV, I hate to tell you guys, by the way, it's the Department of Public Safety. DPS. Yeah, DPS. Yeah. Yeah, I but, learned that. Yeah, and uh, uh, and we learned. Well, one of us learned everything else that everyone else doesn't know. We yeah. learned that I love my mother-in-law, and I admit it. Yes! Yes! Admit it! Still a great Just night. Shine on, you crazy diamonds. Whee! Let's hear it for Jomo.